Hello everybody, this is Infinite, and this is the fifth and final match between Sen, spawning here as the Red Zerg, and Idra, spawning here as the Blue Zerg. This is the final match, as I said, which means that they are 2-2, two, two, two wins and two losses for each player in this tournament. The map is Metalopolis, as you can see. And just a quick recap, the first game and the second game, Iger went on the offensive and Sen managed to hold off Iger's attacks and Iger GG'd out. Game three was on Steps of War and uh, Iger's mass Hydras beat out Sen's Roaches. And the fourth game was on Lost Temple and if you haven't seen that, you should go watch it right now, because that was an epic, epic game featuring roaches, zerglings, banelings, rude lords, and as you can see right here, I am a baller, so I did uh, did put in a little, little credit to myself here. But back to the game, as you can see, both players here sending their overlords in the wrong direction. Both immediately scouting across with their overlords after that. Sen throwing down a spawning pool on 14, I would say. Let's bring up the production tab just so we can see that. Idra going for the hatchery before the spawning pool. Not the best idea, perhaps, on Metalopolis with these spawns. These spawn locations are really, really close to each other. This this distance right here is really short. Perhaps if they had spawned, you know, here and here, it would have been a little better for Idra's hatch before spawning pool, but we'll see how it plays out. And he is getting the spawning pool now. He is getting his extractor. Um, he isn't getting it before the spawning pool, so he isn't going to have speedlings in time when the spawning pool finishes but given this early extractor I would say he's probably gonna go for a baneling build and Sen throwing down a hatchery of his own sending his overlord out they're both gonna see each other they did did a little overlord high five on the way over Sen is sending out his zerglings to do a little scout and or harass I do like this move he is gonna send this I assume to this watchtower um, I suppose he is not actually. I would have liked to see him send that to that watchtower just so we can get a nice view on everything. But both players do have Zerglings out on the field. Sen is throwing down, as we've seen in all these games so far, a quick spine crawler is going to march it over to his expansion. I just got his expansion going and. He has 100, 150, 150 plus gas. I'm not sure what he's using it for. He is throwing down a Roach Warren. But he hasn't used any of his gas yet, so I'm not sure what he's saving that for. And he's going to snipe his Overlord over here. Now that's going to suck for Sen. Um, he is... He is supply capped at 28 right now, so that is not a good start for Sen. But he is throwing down his own Roach Warren. I don't believe he has actually seen, he has not seen Idra's Roach Warren himself. So both players going for the same build, even throwing down a Spinecrawler at Idra's expansion. Here come the Zerglings. No speed upgrade, as you can see. Sen is actually getting his speed upgrade pretty quickly, but Idra has his Roach Warren done and he is morphing uh, three, four Roaches now. So if Sen isn't prepared, he has been powering drones pretty hard. Let's take a look at the income tab. I, I guess they both have the same number of drones, but looks like... Hydra is going to have the first roach advantage. He does have two, he does have four roaches out actually. And Sen is actually still powering drones. I'm not sure how good of an idea this is. He's getting a fast Evo chamber as well for that 
Roach upgrade on the attack. He does have an extractor looking idle right now. Um, his metabolic boost is almost done. Here comes a spine crawler doing a little pokey poke action, throwing down two more extractors. And I really don't think this is the best play for Sen right now, given these short rest distances. Hydra is. He is uh, marching over 12 roaches over to Sen's base, and Sen's overlord de does. Excuse me, Sen's overlord does catch sight of that. And here come. He does have the metabolic boost done. And here goes the spine crawler. Here comes the roaches, and they are going to take down those zerglings with no problem. The spine crawler is going to go down easy. Sen pulling drones off the line to deal with these roaches. Even pulling his overlords to try to get Idra to focus these overlords on accident. Not sure that's going to do anything since roaches cannot hit air. Uh, one queen goes down, two queens go down in a blazing acid inferno. And somewhat of a disappointingly short conclusion to this best of five match. And that is going to be it, ladies and gentlemen. Idra does win the series, three wins to two. So Idra going for that quick, that quick end all with the roaches, and it may, it may inspire some of you to call cheese or that's weak, you know. But that I think he uh, did have the proper strategy on this map with these spawn locations, since this rush distance is quite short. And Sen powered a little too hard drone-wise. So that's going to be it. I will see you in the next cast. Cheers.